Hello. So, if you are keeping track, which I am, mm. I am still beating Nathan. Last week, actually, both of us did very, very poorly. But the Jaguars won. Yes, but I still beat Nathan by one game. So, we're not going to use Bear's magical picks this time because she led me astray. No. Uh, but I am going to pick in a different manner this time. Oh, this, so the score so far is Lana 71 to 56. Nathan. Not 71 to 56. Oh, sorry. 71 games I picked correctly. And 56. 56 incorrectly. That's a pretty good record. Is it? For somebody that is not actually picking and just drawing randomly, it's... It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Um, what's yours, Nathan? My record is 62 and 65. You mean you have more losses than wins? Yeah. So, but if you consider I've picked the Jaguars every week, that's 12 games. They won twice, though. Okay, so that's 10 games that I probably would not have picked. And so I would have had a 10-game difference, which puts me in a tie with you, actually. So you're saying that picking the Jaguars is a huge mistake and you never should have done it. Picking the Jaguars is a challenge that I have lived up to and will overcome. All right. We started, we're doing it early this week. We, ne we always forget to do the Thursday games. But because it's Thanksgiving tomorrow, they have three games. And if we miss that, then you miss like half the game. Then games. what's the point? What's the point, she says, with the point on her head. All right, so the first game is, and how are you picking this week? Come here. I want to kiss you. Nope. Please. You're going to thump me in the head with that thing. No. All right. Uh, okay, I'm picking with this deck of cards. And how, how are we defined as far as? So black, if I choose a black card, it's the home team. Mm. If I choose a red card, it's the away team. Mm. Um, also, as you'll see in our main channel video, I burnt my arm with a curling iron. Takes three band-aids to cover that sucker up. Yep. Okay. Hi, Bear. Ready? Hi. Hi. So the first game we have Hi. is... is <laughs> ah, you just hit me in the face. Is Green Bay versus Detroit. I'm going Detroit. Yee! Um, I'm going Green Bay. It's a black card. No, it's red. Red card. All right. Okay. Next game, Oakland at Dallas. I'm going Dallas. Corbin going, Dallas, Dallas, my man. Uh, huh? Corbin, Corbin Dallas, my man. Why are you talking like that? It's from the Fifth Element. Uh, <laughs> Oakland versus Dallas. Oakland. Wow. All right. Uh, Pittsburgh versus Baltimore. I'm going Baltimore. Home teams. I'm also going Baltimore. I pick all home teams. It's, all right. Jacksonville at Cleveland. Have you learned from your mistakes? Yeah. I'm picking Jacksonville. <gasps> What? Don't pick against them. Shock. Yeah. You are Cleveland. picking Cleveland. I wasn't on purpose. I did it a card. Tennessee game. at Indianapolis. Wait, are, is Jacksonville going to win this time? Probably not. I don't know. They have similar records. Oh. No, really? that's not true. Are the Browns that bad? Uh, actually, the Browns have a pretty good record. Okay. Uh, Tennessee at Indianapolis. Going to Indianapolis. Tennessee. Chicago at Minnesota. Minnesota. I also want to pick Minnesota, but I think Chicago is going to win. Chicago. What happened to the Bears last week, by the way? I was looking up. They lost by a lot. Yeah, they got blown up. No. Did they? Yeah. Then, and then, yeah. Who did they play? The team that blew them up. Okay. Good talk. Uh, okay. <laughs> Miami is next. Miami at the New York Jets. I'm picking Miami. I'm also picking Miami. I'm going to Miami. Happy yes, to Miami. Yami, yami, yami. The, what? <laughs> <laughs> you know the lyrics? No, no, it? it's like. <laughs> Papa, I see Papa, Miami. It's bienvenidos a Miami. All right. Which means welcome to Miami in Spanish. Bienvenidos to you. No, bienvenidos. Bienvenidos to I you. I am an Espanol speaker. Uh, Arizona at really? Philadelphia. Philly. Philadelphia as well. Tampa Bay at Carolina. 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 
Nangland at Houston. Nangland. New England. It's going to be so boring. Atlanta at Buffalo. Atlanta. I think, I think I'm going to pick the home team again. Buffalo in the cold. You would. Why do you keep zooming in on me? Why do you keep looking at yourself? Is the Pope Catholic? Is the Pope Catholic? Yes. Oh, yeah. Then yes. Um, that had nothing to do with what you asked me. I was no. just curious. St. Louis um, at San Francisco. San Francisco. Me too. Denver at Kansas City. Denver. Denver. This is so boring. Cincinnati at San Diego. Cincinnati. San Diego. Giants at Washington. Giants. Giants. And Monday night's game, New Orleans at Seattle. New Orleans. Also New Orleans. This is going to be pretty close well, either way. We've got three or four that we picked different. Yeah. So. Um, I have a question for you, Nathan. I have an answer for you, Lana. So do all, so how do they decide who has to play on Thanksgiving? Because none of those people gets to spend the holiday with their families. Detroit and Dallas always play on Thanksgiving. Why? As per tradition, they, that, as long as I, I, I remember, they always play. I, and I believe they always play at home on Thanksgiving. That's so mean. They have families. They do have families, but they also get paid a lot of money to, to do that. You can't put a price on family. One million dollars. Look, I have freckles. Mm. So okay. those are the picks this week. Tune in next week where we get to see me in some sort of state of disrepair and our sadness. When I continue to lose to my wife, who's picking randomly. <laughs> and if you haven't been following, whoever wins at the end of the season uh, gets to pick their prize. Mine is we're going to a spa weekend. And mine is we're going to go camping. Doesn't look good for camping right now.